Well, robots are invading a new arena in medicine, and most of us have heard about robotic technology in laboratories or operating rooms. And now that same technology is helping stroke patients. Cynthia Newsom tells us it's all about fun and games. Scott Norman is a self-proclaimed walking miracle. Okay, go ahead and put your arm in there. Five months ago, he had a stroke. Couldn't move arm, no. Completely paralyzed. My arm was completely paralyzed. Scott went from being paralyzed to playing video games. And this is no ordinary joystick. It's a robotic device called Armio Spring. St. Luke's has the only one in the Kansas City area. The mechanical arm supports his arm, but Scott makes all the moves. Even the slightest movement, it, it, you know, as you can see, the, the cursor, it actually follows on the screen, so it gives me an interactive uh, ability to see, and I'm getting the feedback from watching it on the screen as well as moving my arm. Now, this is an MRI of Scott's brain. This is the damaged area right here. Now, as he's playing the video game, he's activating other areas of the brain to take over responsibilities of this damaged area, and that will allow Scott to lift his arm again. The objective is not to make the therapy fun, but if we can make the therapy fun, the patients are more likely to, uh, to do the therapy and do it longer, which may help with their brain recovery. My range here to here to here, much better. Praise the Lord. Scott is even coaching baseball again and setting goals. Now my goal is to be able to throw batting practice to my uh, baseball team uh, by summer. And with this robot, he's on his way. Cynthia Newsom, 41 Action News.